Hello! Today, I want to tell you about getting or setting HTML content in .NET Browser. First of all, we need to create a WPF project, reference the .NET Browser library via Nugget, and add the license file. You can find the detailed instructions in the previous tutorials. Our next step is main window markup. Add the .NET Browser XML namespace to the main window. Create two columns and two rows in the root grid. Add the WPF browser view to the left side of the window. Specify the initial URL and create the finish loading frame event handler. Add the set HTML button to the top right cell of the grid, set its name and create the click event handler. Add the text box to the bottom right cell of the grid. This text box will be used for displaying and modifying the HTML content of the browser view. Now let's implement the main window behavior. First of all, let's update the text box content. Go to the finish loading frame event handler and open the dispatcher begin invoke instruction. Inside the begin invoke, fill the HTML text box text property value with the result of the browser view browser get HTML method. This handler will update the text box content every time the browser finishes loading any frame. Go to the button click handler, and inside this handler, call the browser view browser load HTML method and pass the text box content as its argument. Now you can build and launch your application. Thanks for watching.